Part 1 Introduction to Cultural Literacy Welcome to our exploration of cultural literacy from antiquity to the post-COVID era. In this presentation, we'll examine how cultural literacy has evolved and its significance in modern education through the lens of Jacques Lacan. My name is Brian L. Austin, and this presentation is based on my literature review for EDA 748 Section 1 Introduction Cultural Literacy has transformed significantly, shaping education systems globally. Our focus is on Jacques Lacan's theories from Seminar She, which provide insights into current educational practices during this era of disruptive change. This approach aims to reform the semantics educators use to discuss cultural literacy, enhancing inclusivity and reflective teaching. Section 2, Historical Context. Cultural literacy is the ability to understand and participate in a given culture. It has its roots in ancient civilizations, where education systems ensured the transmission of cultural knowledge and values. Plato's Republic highlights the role of education in shaping cultural understanding. The direction in which education starts a man will determine his future life. Plato, C380 BCE. This quote shows the necessary significance of correctly addressing cultural literacy and aligns with the idea that education shapes not only knowledge but also cultural understanding. Joseph Campbell's The Power of Myth with Bill Moyers offers profound insights into the importance of myths in shaping cultural identity. Campbell argues, there has to be training to help you open your ears so that you can begin to hear metaphorically instead of concretely Campbell and Moyers, 1988. This underscores that cultural literacy extends beyond surface-level identity politics to deeper mythological and symbolic narratives that shape individuals' understanding of the world. Section 3, Lacan's Influence. Jacques Lacan's seminar She offers profound insights into the unconscious processes that shape individual and collective cultural understandings. Lacan's concepts of the symbolic, imaginary, and real provide a framework for analyzing how cultural narratives are internalized and manifested in educational settings. Lacan emphasizes that the unconscious is structured like a language Lacan, 1977. This perspective underscores the importance of language in shaping cultural understanding and aligns with the need for educators to recognize and address the unconscious influences on cultural literacy. Furthermore, Lacan's assertion that the unconscious is the discourse of the other Lacan, 1977 highlights the role of cultural context in shaping individual identities. This insight is crucial for developing educational practices that are sensitive to the diverse cultural backgrounds of students. 